What's going on YouTube? This is Anthony and there's tons of rumors going around about the iPhone 6s and 6s Plus. Uh, here's a couple that I believe that it actually is going to happen 100% and there's a couple I don't think are very slim chance of happening. So the thing that I think is going to happen, number one is the A9 processor. Uh, Apple does this every year where they upgrade the processor and make it faster and that's been what they've been doing since the iPhone 4 pretty much and probably before that. Um, so they, I heard two gigs of RAM. They're doubling up on their RAM, which I'm hoping they do. It's not that big of a deal to double it up and it's something they can make easily do. And I believe that's gonna happen. So they're supposed to improve the camera to 12 megapixels. I believe it's happening. Um, about a week ago, I didn't think it was gonna happen, but too many published reports and inside stuff says that is gonna happen. So. 12 megapixels would be great. Um, their sensors are great already, so up in the megapixels, it's a plus, excuse me. Um, let's see, uh, Force Touch, definitely, because uh, Apple loves the success of the Apple Watch, the Force Touch feature, people really love it, and it's gonna be a great addition to their lineup of, you know, something unique to the iPhone, and I think it's gonna be great. It's gonna add a whole other functionality to the iPhone it's gonna be great. I think it's gonna be awesome. So um, and prove their for touch ID, which you know they would have, even though it works perfectly. But you know, here and there, sometimes you won't be able to get in because of moisture or oils on your fingers. They'll probably in, uh, enhance their sensor there to make it a lot easier. So kudos for that. Uh, there's gonna be a gold, rose gold, silver, and space gray colors. I'm not sure about rose gold, but I wouldn't get it anyways. But I think that's happening just to add another color to the mix. Um, as far as the Apple Watch goes, uh, this is my wife's. I don't, I don't like butterflies. Um, <laughs> it's uh, hopefully they get into more of the OS 2 for the Apple Watch. It's supposed to improve it, make it faster. Even though my wife is very satisfied with uh, the way that it functions, she's probably be, she's gonna love the way part two is. She's not really much into tech, but when she sees how faster it gets, um, it might even make me get one, but I'll probably make wait for the next generation of the Apple Watch if it intrigues me enough. Because right now I don't really see too much of a point because I'd rather just take my phone out and see everything, you know, the way I want to see it, you know, so we'll see. So let me know what you think is going to happen. Um, I was hoping 4K video would be in a new iPhone, but it kind of looks like that's not happening, which is not a big deal. It's a big deal to non-Apple users for some reason because they like to throw the 4K in our face about, oh, this this phone has this, this phone has that. I really don't care. Apple does what they want. And this seems to be working, right? Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. All right, this is Anthony from Arrowhead Tech. You guys let me know what you think. Bye.